few tales are told of Hades, whose very name inspires fear and penitence, reminding us of the inevitable fate which we all share. I, however, mean to tell you such a tale. Listen carefully. Goodbye, Father. To hell with this place. Whoops. goes nothing. <clears throat> In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Hail, noble cousin. Now, let's get you from that miserable place. I'll see that all of us upon Olympus do our part, beginning here with me. can't hear me all the way where you are, goddess, but thank you. Blasted wretches. Each exit has its own reward. this. I'm hurt. Can't heal myself, but I can fight.
absorbed my blow. I'm home. <clears throat> yes, carry on, everyone. Don't mind me. What? Uh, what? <laughs> Welcome to the House of Hades, where... Wait, I know you. Guess that means you died out there, huh? Well, don't be sad, though. Pretty much everybody dies sometime. Some of us more than others. Back already. Stupid boy. I told you nobody gets out of here, whether alive or dead. So how is your wanton ransacking of my domain? Greetings, father. My ransacking was a delight, thank you for asking. So I'll just be on my way again. Be on your way indeed. What do I care? You shall never reach the surface. Go, see for yourself. What is it now? 
of a mountain of infernal parchment work. Out of my sight now, go. Nothing for me here. There's a good boy. Cease bothering the dog. <laughs> Infernal watchdog Cerberus regards the underworld prince with mixed emotions, from purest joy to deepest melancholy. You watch over things for me, won't you, boy? You know I'd take you if I could. If I sit down, I won't want to get back up. Come home. Do not despair, child. Such setbacks are inevitable and may be overcome with effort and with time. You made contact with the goddess Athena. She shall be true to her word. I believe it, Nyx. I'm grateful that you put us into contact. I know you took a considerable risk in reaching out. The risk is not to me. I expected the Olympians would involve themselves in this eventually. Reveal to them no more than they already know. Are we understood? Yes, we are. Then go. You've returned. Good to see you, lad. Despite the circumstances, remember your training out there. The pain of death is but another obstacle. And fear is for the weak. Take care, Achilles. The House of Hades. That dark and lavishly appointed lair of the Underworld's king is home not just to him, but to his willful progeny. You know I can hear you, old man. Hey, room. I'm back. Night and darkness guide me. Felt that, I think. The bedchambers of Prince Zagreus lie in a perpetual state of utter disarray, despite his lord and master of the house repeatedly insisting that he pick everything up. Oh, come on, it's not that bad, is it? It's never bedtime here. Okay. Empty for now. That's going to take more keys. I can escape through that pink window there. Ready as I'll ever be. Thunder. Is that... Is this really him? Okay. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Greetings there, young man. Look, your father's always been rather difficult, and he's not so much as called in quite some time. You'll have a better home where you belong, here on Olympus. And to help you on your journey, have my blessing.
Lord Uncle Zeus lending his support. Never thought I'd see the day, or night, whenever. Fix that for you. Composed of such innumerable, ever-shifting, interlocking chambers, the underworld of Lord Hades all but guarantees the dead shall there remain until the end of time. Good thing I'm not dead. Lord Uncle Zeus, in the name of Hades. Now 
something back home. They got me. No way to patch up. Got to keep going. Oh no. How foolhardy of you. Whoops. Enough. This one was bound to show up, I guess. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. You've got quite the fighting spirit in you there, I have to say. Most intriguing, and yet no surprise for someone born in hell itself. You come on out of there and tell me all about it. I'm a fellow student of death, you see. See what's in here. Bot. Don't think I've gone this far. me something. Oh, it's her.
must be a mess. Let's see here. Hi there. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Why, hello, hello there, little godling. I have to say, you're quite the specimen, and so I've decided I shall aid you for the moment. You interested? No love without pain. Beyond the present chamber lies the outermost perimeter of Tartarus, promising terrifying dangers far beyond the Underworld Prince's reckoning. And I can reckon quite a bit. Well, this is awkward. <laughs> halt, Sagrius. Not one step further. Come on, Meg. Haven't we had more than enough of each other by now? Besides, don't you have some place else to be? Your father sent me. All in all, I'd rather be on your bad side than his. Now you can turn back, like a good little man, or I can send you home the painful way. What'll it be? I'll have to go with the painful way. A man after my own heart. Cheers for that, Meg. What? Oh, wow, so Megara herself got you last time. That must have been intense. She's fast and strong and beautiful. And, um, anyway, I hope the fates are nicer to you next time. Yeah, I hope so, too. Someone's at the desk next to the throne. Who's that sniveling shade to your immediate left there, father? Already found someone new to do the busy work. And here I thought I was utterly indispensable. That shade, boy, is my newly designated contractor. One whose responsibility is to work on this house. Though who shall pay for everything my subjects here demand, I do not know. You're trying to guilt me into funding the exorbitant furnishings you desire. Perhaps once we are finished with repairs for all the carnage you have sown throughout my realm, then we might finally have time for all the needed renovations that have piled up. Nice. Some sort of special offer for me, my good shade. Work authorized. A fountain chamber in the depths of Tartarus sounds like an excellent idea. What's that there? Something from the Fates? must be someplace else. I can get stronger. All right, I'm ready. I should go. Can't open this yet. There we go. Aegis, shield of chaos. Lend me your power. Ooh, look what at the? that. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Nice 
place you got here, boyo. Name Skelly has it going, but enough with the smart talk already. I'm here to do a job. So let me have it. Give me everything you got. I don't remember having you on payroll, mate. Who's your supervisor? Oh, I'm not about to wrap my sources, pal. Just try and beat it out of me. If you insist. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Bet I got you pretty good. Stygius, Blade of the Underworld, I need your strength. <laughs> 